Wow. <laughs> Great start to a stream. Yep. Real good. Good. Real. Keep it classy, me. Anyway. <laughs> Let's actually get this game started so I can stop making an idiot of myself. I mean, so I can continue making an idiot, idiot of myself. But in a slightly more directed way, I guess. <laughs> huh, okay, yes. Good evening. Oh, wait, okay, yeah, that's my... I opened my notes and I was looking at my, um... What am I looking at? Oh, that was my, yeah, that was my Dragon Spirit notes. <laughs> Not my picture of the notes. Good evening, welcome to Cooks Are Delicious 2 stream. Another one. An, an apology to the CEO, Matt McKimbo. Hello, fellow gamers, Matt McKimbo here, CEO of Digitize Digital. Oops, I am just, I did forgot to put my mic down. And I want to personally apologize for the launch issues of Bouncing Bahoolies 6 Miami. This is not the Bouncing Bahoolies experience our fans have come to expect from us, and I assure you that many bug fixes and patches are on the way. I also am proud to offer a 10% off discount for our season pass as a way of saying we're sorry, as well as a free open beta for Bouncing Bahooli 7, Cancun. And rest assured this will never happen again. Thank you and keep on gaming. Matt McKimbo, CEO of Digitize Digital. Well, he seems at least like a slightly more decent person than Robert uh, Overling, but that's, uh, that's not saying much. So, um... I was thinking about uh, other possible like ingredients to do a theme menu for. I, I want to try pineapple. I don't think there's a lot of pineapple dishes. I know there's some, but I'm guessing there might not be enough to fill out a full menu. But uh, I'm going to try it anyway. But not right now. First, I'm going to do some tower restaurants. Starting with XLR Purple. Sorry, I'm... I Mess with my teeth a lot. I had I just ate and like there's probably still food stuck in my teeth, so sorry, I'll try not to be too gross. <laughs> okay, so souffle, uh salad, lasagna, pork loin, veal marsala, uh side salad, pakoras, um, 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 um coffee and red wine. I forgot what coffee was. <laughs> <laughs> Another um, idea I had was for, for a, a featured ingredient was chocolate. I know there's a lot of stuff with chocolate in it. <laughs> okay, lasagna, salad. I love it when um, I'll do a stream on the evening. I'll be like smiling and laughing and everything and having a great time. And then later, 
uh, when I go to brush my teeth and get ready for bed, I'll discover that I had, like, food in my teeth or something the whole time. And I didn't notice. <laughs> and nobody told me. And I'll just be like, oh god. <laughs> Hopefully, uh, hopefully it's, uh, if that does happen, it's, it's small enough that it's not a huge distraction. Cheese and ice cream. That's probably better than I think it is. That's one of those things that sounds really weird, but it's actually really good. It probably has to be the right kind of cheese, though. I'm thinking of, like, um, um, some places you can get boba with, like, uh, with like a cheese, uh, salted cheese uh, top. Um, and that's really good. Sounds super weird. Surprisingly good. I don't know if that would translate well to like ice cream, but I don't know. People make out ice cream out of all kinds of things. Like Old Spice. <laughs> that, that, like, I swear I've heard of that before, but I, I don't actually remember hearing about it. Like, I, my brain insists that yes, this is a thing. But I don't remember it ever actually being a thing. Okay, maybe that's what I was thinking of. But like, I, I, maybe actually I saw it like on my feed somewhere, but didn't actually watch the video. Okay, I gotta check that out then. <laughs>
bad time to start dishwasher. here. Okay, good, there. Perfect day, I believe. Yeah! Excellent. Perfecto! We just read this. Like, literally just read that. <laughs> okay. So. That's on day 11 now. Okay, next up is Gre Italy. Uh, lasagna again. Quiche. Veal marsala again. Uh, spaghetti meatballs. Tiramisu. White rice. Green beans. Beer and red wine. Ready, there you go. Crap. Come on, hurry up with the side dishes. There we go. had a <laughs> just a big old uh, dish of seasoning and nothing else. No actual green beans in there. <laughs> it's like uh, bell peppers and beef. But there's no beef. 
Oops. <laughs> I forgot how to lasagna. That was a lovely mess I just made. <laughs> Just a layer of meat and a bunch of spinach. <laughs> there you go. <laughs> Lasagna. <laughs> Old family recipe. Like, uh, it's like deconstructed lasagna, only it's more like unfinished lasagna. <laughs> deconstructed as in, I dropped it on the floor and this is all I could salvage. <laughs> Invite, invite my daughter's sweet 16. Greetings, all Tarragon Tower residents. You were invited to my daughter's sweet 16 birthday party next week, Saturday at 3 p.m. Attire is formal, and the little darling has asked that admittance only be permitted to those able to produce proof that they have brought a gift worth at least $200. She believes this will weed out the moochers and lower level residents. Hope to see you there. Marguerite, extension 8004. I question whether that's actually the, uh, the kid's idea or the mother's idea. Shackers is next. We got the chicken sandwich, biscuits and gravy, fried chicken, uh, chicken strips, chicken finger, or I mean, um, chicken nuggets, uh, pie, toast, um, fried okra, soda, and iced tea. That's a fun menu. Oh, steak finger, sorry, not chicken. I can never tell if I'm looking at them. I wish this game actually labeled the dishes instead of just having you like... Oops, why did I do that? That's not what I wanted to do, hold on. Um, I, okay, I screwed this up. Wait, okay. I want the chicken nuggets. I want the toast. There we go. <laughs> I confused myself. 
did things in a weird order and I was like, wait a minute. Brain, stop working. Serve those biscuits without gravy, although I think I should be able to let you do that. Damn, I forgot to brew the damn tea. Wait, no I didn't, no. I brewed it, but I put the wrong, it was the wrong tea. That's what I did. I think. I'll double check when I get another tea order. Pretty sure I brewed it. I, okay, I picked the wrong one. Yeah, I, actually, I, I picked, uh, I served passion tea instead of peach tea. That's what I did.
Oh, shit. Too many drumsticks, not enough breasts. There's a shortage of perfect breasts in this world, and also in this order of chicken. <laughs> Do one more here, and then we'll do a we'll do a themed uh, we'll try another themed menu in in the main restaurant. World tour. Uh, uh, le, 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 Salisbury steak. I forgot what it was called. Uh, fried fish, momos, chipichangas, sopapillas, uh, uh, samosas, soup, sunflower choke, iced tea, and red wine. I just playing oh oh yeah so I <laughs> I started playing um, Uncharted the first one uh, I have the remastered uh, trilogy on PS4 and I just remembered that Nathan talks about soup <laughs> at one point in the first game it's like I found a bunch of like like oh yeah like there's a bunch of blood and soup <laughs> And of course, my brain immediately went, I'm not soup! <laughs> mm. Why are you buying soup in the abandoned German U boat? <laughs> Percentage counter is to be believed. Oh, hi, kitten. Oh, here he is. Hold on. Potential, potential cat. Hard mode. Becoming activated. Hi. I want to be on my lap. <laughs> Stomping on my legs. There's his tail. <laughs> yeah, that's that's kind of the impression I'm getting out of it. Like, it, it it's a little like oh god. There's like a couple things in it so far that are like ooh mm, eh, maybe maybe we, we wouldn't do that these days. But it's not that it's not that bad. I was expecting much worse actually. <laughs> But yeah, it's fun, and I was uh, I was worried about the the gun fights because uh, I remember hearing that they were very bad. Um, but apparently, the remastered version uh, improves them significantly, um, and I'm not having too much trouble with them, so that's good. Kitten, are you gonna settle down on top of my arm like you like to do? Here he goes. Okay. Cat induced hard mode has been activated. I will now attempt to play this game with limited movement in my left arm. <laughs> Aww. I'm so happy.
Crispy Lime Challenge Mode. <laughs> I figure that's how people actually bother to watch these streams on, on, on the off chance that uh, that Marsh will show up and make it like double hard. <laughs> Uh, forget games done quick. Games done with the cat on your arm. <laughs> okay, yes, peach tea is E, not P. far through this game am I? I'm most of the way through it. Um, I mean, my, my goal in, uh, in, this in these streams is just to unlock everything, um, but not necessarily get like full completion. Um, so I'm, I'm pretty close to being done. But some of it is like it's it, the game doesn't doesn't really make it super obvious what the unlock requirements for some of the stuff is, so it's kind of hard to tell in some ways. Also, hello. <laughs> I have been playing it for a while. I know. <laughs> But yeah, that's why I'm not going for full completion on stream, just because I've, A, I've done it already, and uh, you've already been watching me play this game for ages, and it would probably just get, it's already, it's already, I would say it's welcome, but I want to keep doing it just because I have a goal stated, and I want to actually hit that goal. <laughs> yeah. <laughs> I know, I know. <laughs> But also, it's fun. I like playing this game. I have probably been playing it for too long, but I do enjoy it, so... But anyway, yeah, once uh, once I'm done with this, uh, I'll probably actually play a, an actual backlog game like I intended this <laughs> Tuesday nights to be backlog day. And then it kind of got derailed <laughs> for reasons. And because I'm stubborn, I stuck with the derailing. It's been a it's been a very long tangent. <laughs> Let's 
Was that a perfect day? Yeah, it was. Yay! Okay. Artificial sweat. Ricky Kitty. <laughs> He's got his arm just like hanging off my arm. <laughs> the sequel to the one game. Oh, Little Big Adventure. Uh, no. <laughs> I tried. <laughs> I tried playing uh, Little Big Adventure 2, and but I it, it stopped being fun. I stopped enjoying it, so... Uh, I decided that it was not worth continuing to play it, and I moved on to something else. So I'm playing Dragon Sphere on Monday nights now instead of that, and oh my god, it's so good! <laughs> yeah, the sequel was better. It, 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 did, it did make some definite improvements on the first game, and it was less frustrating, which is why I stuck with it for as long as I did. I stuck with it for like... Probably like at least twice as long two or three times as long, probably twice as long, as I stuck with the first game. Because the first game I, I did four sessions and then I was like, nope, <laughs> can't handle this anymore. <laughs> um, but yeah, second one lasted considerably longer and then I was like, eh, yeah, nope, I'm done. I, this, is, this is just bringing up old bad memories of the first game now and I, I no longer care. Okay, uh, let's do what I was said I was going to do, which is pineapple for the for a themed menu. So let's see. What do I have that I can put pineapple on? Um, I might have, might be kind of limited here, but let's see. Uh, I don't think I can put, I don't think I can put pineapple on hamburgers, which is a shame because pineapple on hamburger is great. Uh, Technically, wok dishes would count, because even though pineapple isn't a direct ingredient, sweet and sour is. And there's pineapple in sweet and sour. So maybe. We'll, we'll hold that one in reserve. <laughs> okay, pizza. Uh, pizza definitely has pineapple in it. Um, or as a potential uh, topping. Yeah, there's not a lot. Sandwich. Hmm. I know Carpaccio has pi has a has pineapple, but I don't think I had that one unlocked. I might not be able to really make a significant pineapple-based menu here. I know the bean burger has it as a as a uh, as a topping. Do I not have whole pizza unlocked? Oh, I do. Okay, there it is. Okay, yeah, bean burger. Oops. Wait. Yeah. Bean burger, keep that in there. Uh, ramen does not have pineapple in it. Pizza. That salad does not have pineapple in it. Oh, I do have carpaccio. Sweet. I think that might be all. I think I have any other pineapple things I can put on the menu. Okay, well then let's uh, let's 
pick something pineapple adjacent. <laughs> Well, the uh, the second game had save had a, had save states. Um, you could save whenever you wanted in the second one, which is great. Um, first one you could not, which yeah was terrible, and I hated it. But um, yeah, second one I could save whenever I wanted, so I, I saved scummed the crap out of that game. Let's do... let's do that. That's not... It doesn't have pineapple in it, but... Actually, you know, uh, let's, let's do what I said I was going to do and do sweet and sour. Let's do the chicken. Why pineapple? I don't know, just because. <laughs> just to see if I can build a, a, a reasonable menu of, of things that, that all have pineapple in them. Um, I, it's, it's a thing I've been... it's a sort of a challenge I've been setting myself for the past couple weeks. Um, Someone, I think it was Siriar, suggested uh, doing a, uh, an all-vegan menu, and I tried that, and it was surprisingly difficult. Um, and then I decided to do, uh, I think based on a suggestion from Oso Mello, uh, we did like a rice-based, like a, we had, I had like everything on the menu had, had rice in it, and then I did avocado. Uh, and now I'm doing pineapple, just because. I don't think there are any side dishes that have pineapple in them, though. So, again, let's just do... Let's do the fruit spread. Yeah, it's just like a little, little self-imposed challenge to make things a little interesting. Uh, what else? I don't know. Um, not a lot of fruit-based side dishes anyway. I don't know. Uh, what could potentially go well with pineapple? Bacon? <laughs> uh... Well, yeah. Well, I already have pizza on my main menu. There's no si there's no pizza side dish, unfortunately. Um, scrambled eggs, oatmeal, grits. Ham. Uh, is there anything I can put ham in? A side dish. Not really. Oh, there's sausage. Okay, we'll do sausage. Bacon and sausage and fruit. <laughs> That's kind of pineapple. -ish. Fortunately, there was a pineapple juice, so we'll obviously put that in there. And then, um, I don't know. Iced tea or soda, maybe? Iced tea. A lone slice of ham, yep. <laughs> okay. Let's try that. Let's see. March, you are so on my arm. <laughs> He's like, yes, I don't care. This is comfy for me. Pineapple tea. Unfortunately, no. I don't think, uh... Hey, there's pineapple. Um, pineapple tea is not an option. Hey, there's sweet and sour, so there. <laughs> I'm, I'm vindicated. <laughs> I think I put the wrong sauce on that first one anyway. Oh well. <laughs> Yeah, but the wrong sauce. Damn it! Okay, good. Yes, there is pineapple in this in the smoothies as well. So, I was not wrong in my guess.
The Tale of the Little Prince. I've never actually read the book, but I, I'm vaguely familiar with it. Kinda, sorta. <laughs> Just everything on fire. <laughs> Literally or figuratively. You were blocking access to my keyboard. I need it. <laughs> he keeps like oozing onto my keyboard tray and like pushing my keyboard in underneath my desk. It makes it hard to reach. <laughs> game only pets <laughs> Almost 
put the wrong ingredient on that pizza. Quite perfect, but close. Cool. All right, that was that was pineapple. <laughs> Event invitation to my Thursday night shopping. I go grocery shopping on Thursday nights. It's pretty lonely. Does anyone want to, does anyone want to come with me? Raising money for a children's book. Hello, everyone. I'm now accepting donations to aid in my creation of a brand new and special children's book, which is which is inspired by my experiences in this very building. The book will teach the children valuable lessons, such as the importance of eating vegetables, being honest, and making the lives of wealthy upper floor residents a living hell in the name of cosmic justice. Leave any donations to my mailbox. Franny, extension 5505. Okay, back to tower restaurants. So burrito time is next. Luciana Webb, thank you for the follow. And welcome. I didn't actually greet you when you showed up. I apologize for that. But welcome, and hello. <laughs> Oops, I didn't, okay, it's fine. Burrito time. Uh, burrito, of course, quesadillas, um, enchiladas, uh, milkshakes, donuts, tamales, black beans, white rice, horchata, and lemonade. Any uh, menu that involves burritos is always going to be uh, always going to be stressful, just because there are so many ingredients. <laughs> Okay. Uh. Crap. This is 
expected I might have messed up one of those things. Ah, jeez. Okay, cat. <laughs> have you decided to get off my lap? Or are you just gonna stand there? Shit. Ah, dang it. What are you doing? <laughs> What are you? What? What are you doing? <laughs> You're just standing on, on the arm of my chair now. <laughs> okay, back on my lap. All right, change your mind. Yes, hi. Yeah, you can definitely get uh, get higher than uh, than a hundred. Oof. Oh god. <laughs> Can you make yourself any heavier? <laughs> I swear to god, this cat is made of black hole. <laughs> Jesus. <laughs> this is very difficult. Oh shit. Oh no, that was right. Okay, good. I just did things out of order. I'm sitting very lopsided because of the cat on my lap. No game, only pets. <laughs> Sorry, I spaced out to look how you ordered a burrito. I'm sorry I can't make your burrito for you. There's a cat on my arm. I know, cats aren't allowed in this restaurant, but uh, he just kind of came in. I couldn't do anything about it. Oh, well, that could have been better. <laughs> I blame you, March. That was your fault. All of my mistakes at the, uh, from here from here on will, of course, be blamed on on this cat. <sighs> Warning: glue spill. Terragon management. Attention, all persons at the Terragon Tower. Please be advised that a huge vat of glue has exploded on the 52nd floor, right outside Cook Serve Delicious. Allow an extra 10, 10 to 15 minutes travel time, as the glue will slow you down. Regards, Terragon management. I hope that I've gotten my food. 
Okay, next up is absolutely. The soup restaurant. Soup, of course. Creme brulee. I guess that's kind of soup. <laughs> Uh, gazpacho, beef stew, chili, side gumbo, side soup, iced tea, and craft beer. You're so heavy. <laughs> my arm is just anchored to my keyboard. <laughs> Oops, I didn't want to do that. There we go. Belatedly, um, I don't think you really get any bonuses or anything in particular for, like, reaching certain levels. I think everything you unlock is just, like, based on how many, uh, like, how many medals you get or, or uh, orders you serve or something like that. I don't actually know for sure, for certain. Like I said, the game is a little bit, uh, obtuse about what it actually takes to unlock stuff. Um, or I just don't know where to look for it. <laughs> I mean, it'll say what, um, like, when you do unlock something, it'll say, oh, you re got this many bronze medals or whatever, that, and so you've unlocked this thing. Um, but I don't know if there's a way to look at that before you've unlocked it. Some of my locked uh, foods. Let's see if there's anywhere that it says how exactly to unlock the thing. Ah! Oh, I I over I think I over I over sugared or I over um, torched it just a tiny bit. something wrong. I've said many times before on this stream, but it's still true.
Oh, we finally decided. He's freed me! My arms! <laughs> I can move my arms again! <laughs> as much as I love having a cat on my lap, it does make playing games difficult. And hilarious. <laughs> of course I know I could just, you know, evict him whenever I want. I'm bigger than him, but, but why would I do that? I can move. <laughs> the force of gravity weighing me down has, has lifted. Okay. Okay. Costo is next. So we have chicken fried meat. We have beef wellington, chicken breast, skewers, ribs, dessert shooters, dinner roll. That's the only side dish. Okay, gotta stay on those. Uh, coffee and beer. Oops. Wait a second. Back to go down to the bottom of my list. There we go. Rabs and rolls.
Okay, speaking of levels, belatedly. something wrong, I don't know what it was. I was all sure that I could do a perfect day on this one, but it was not to be. I uh, should make cheesecake again. It's been a long time since I've made a cheesecake. requires like so much planning or rather so much so many ingredients <laughs> mainly just a lot of cream cheese five bricks of the stuff. Which seems excessive. Shit, I'm not keeping on top of the rolls like I said I was going to. I'm slipping. The, some of the seasonings or something.
I did make the mistake I thought I did. Alas. Oh well. Oh, that's a cool statue. Yeah, see, so it says, like, earned, you know, such a su such number of medals, a certain type. And so you want to mock those things. Then I blame the cat, yes. Oh, okay, I was wrong. So there are stuff, there, there, are, there are things that you unlock by leveling up. My mistake. See, I don't pay attention to these things. <laughs> Excellent work. Oh yeah, and and you do you do also unlock new um, shifts in the tower restaurants by leveling up. But I've already unlocked them all, so we won't see the, see that that message anymore. Yes, I'll blame the cat, even though he's no longer on my lap. <laughs> it's a residual residual cat weight <laughs> on my on my arms. I'm still I'm still recovering. Okay, let me see. Uh, let me see if. Uh, we're not reading. <laughs> we're not reading anything more from Robert Overling because he sucks. Uh, let me see what. Um, the, oops. Oh, one. Ah, got eight. There we go. Only locked. Does it actually say? Yeah, it doesn't say. Uh, what I need to do to unlock it. I think also, um, I think some of the unlocks in this game are kind of random. Like, I don't know if everything... I don't know if, like, from game to game, if, say, you know, cake will be unlocked at a, uh, under the same condition as it would be under something else. Like, I suspect that there are, like, conditions that you fulfill, and then once you hit that condition, you unlock, like, a random selection of things. Um, maybe. I, I actually don't know for, for sure. I'm just wildly speculating and I could be completely wrong. So definitely do not take anything I say as, <laughs> as gospel. Okay, uh, good Japan. Second to last day on this one. Um, Okonomiyaki, Yaki Tomonokoshi, Shrimp Wok Dish, Egg Roll or Egg Drop Soup, Fried rice, chicken wok dish, egg rolls, uh, side fried rice, soda, and lemonade. And then after this one, we'll be able to. Uh, the next batch of restaurants only has one day open left, one more shift open. So we'll cross all those off the list. That's exciting. Something.
Oh god. Actual meat, that's important. No oh, shit. No. Ah. That is the wrong thing. Added squid, should have been shrimp. Blame the cat. <laughs> March, this is all your fault. Serve that before it was finished. Press the wrong button. Boo. Okay, there we go. <laughs> well, I could have gone better, but it could have been worse too. As I, I say that a lot while I'm playing this game. <laughs> okay. 
Start a new city. With so many people moving inland due to floods, it just makes sense to me. I don't see any other, any other way out. The cities of today aren't built to support these huge influxes of people. We gotta go out there like pioneers and start building a new home. What do you say? VGI. Visionary. Okay. So. We now have a bunch of... A bunch of restaurants with only one day left, or one shift left. So let's go ahead and finish those up. Starting with pyrite. Also finished up my boba. <laughs> Oops! Wait! Hang on. Cake, tiramisu, pie slices, muffins, tres leches cake, no side dishes, um, soda and pineapple juice. Pineapple juice. Ha ha ha. Uh, right, no side dishes. Okay, so just these things. Oop. Two layers. <laughs> Don't have this skinny ass tiramisu. Think about it. It's always like it's it's not what I expect. The button presses is always are a little bit confusing. Oh shit, I fat fingered it. Banana, banana, banana.
Here's my last muffin. Oops. Hang on, hang on. Ready? Oh, okay. Did I say oh boogie? <laughs> I was trying to say oh boy, and I uh, something weird happened to my throat. <laughs> I didn't quite say what I meant to say. Ah, shit. Oh, that was chocolate and not vanilla. I don't, think I've ever, I don't think I've ever done that with, uh, with with cake frosting before. I do it with like with the tiramisu all the time. Not tiramisu, but the um, I do it with the tres leches cake all the time. But very rarely do I do it with uh, with, with frosting the cake. Because I also do it with ice cream a lot too. Because as I've said before, the C and the V keys are right next to each other. It's really easy to mess them up. more hectic than I was expecting. <laughs> okay, well, we are done with Pyrite. No more of that restaurant. Uh, looking for a producer. Hello, everyone. I'm looking for someone interested in producing my very first feature-length film. I'd finance the film myself, and I've gone completely broke from quitting my job to write the script full-time, which I only did because I really, really believe in this movie. It's part of a, pre a planned trilogy biopic about the life of, of Bryce about the life of Bryson. Let me know if you're interested. Bryson is the best. He's better than all the rest, especially you. Okay, sub solutions. Last day of this one. So custom mini sub, um, sub bi big big sub. Salad, soup, club sandwich, breakfast sandwich, potato salad, salad, <laughs> um, uh, soda, and iced tea. Potato salad, not potato salad. Salad entirely devoid of potatoes.
you wouldn't think that making so many sandwiches would seem like such a daunting task, but it does. Sandwiches. wrong button, but fortunately it was actually the right button. <laughs> Why these? Why all these sa um, sandwiches are so stressful? Just because, like, I don't have a good muscle memory for for these combinations. Like, it could really anything can go on a on a, on a sandwich. And there's not really a lot of, like, quick um, brain shortcuts I can take. I actually have to pay attention to all of them. See, like, with those, with those side dishes, with, like, the, uh, the, um, with the salad and the potato salad, like, I already know what buttons to press and I can just mash them really quickly and just have it done. But with uh, things like the tur uh, the um, uh, the sandwiches and the burritos and stuff, I can't I can't rely on that so much. So it slows me down and it it's like oh I'm not gonna make these all in time. batch of soup just for one just for one uh, serving you wasteful bastard justice can't go on a sandwich it's true a sad sad state of affairs 
Did I get that perfect? Did I perfect day that? I did. Wow. Amazing. Yay. And we're done with sub solutions. Excellent. And I have enough money to upgrade my equipment. Let's do that right now. Bug lamps. Uh, we've read that one before. Okay, the deep. Last one here. Uh, fish, fried fish, crab cakes, gumbo, spinach pasta, crab legs, salad, soda, and lemonade. Salad's gonna go quick, so gotta keep an eye on it. Oh. Although the nice thing about the salad is, as soon as it goes, I can just make another one instantly. So I don't really have to keep an eye on it that badly. Just boom, done. <laughs> button mash my way to victory. <laughs> Shit. Uh, I'm not sure I did that right. I might have done that right, actually. I might have accidentally hit the right button. Oh, I don't have to worry about 
this too much. Yes, hi, what? What do you want? I want to go outside. Oh, I hate the dishwasher. <laughs> That was a hard one. Alright. Feel good about myself. That's a cool backsplash. That's a cool eagle. Hold on, I'll be right back. March is staring at me. Very meaningfully. I think he wants to go out. So I'll be right back. One moment. All right. So we are done with the deep. I was hoping I would be able to cross uh, all of the uh, one shift left restaurants off my list tonight, but it looks like I only have time for maybe like one more tonight. So that one more is going to be Far East. Oops, wait, email first. Uh, we've seen that before. Far East, this one. Okay. <sighs> Alright, so we have Yakisakana, we have Agedashi Tofu, Sashimi, Okonomiyaki, Ramen, Hiyayaku Tofu, 
Kazukuri, edamame, craft beer, and red wine. That was a lot of Japanese words I just said. <laughs> red wine and craft beer were not among those Japanese words. <laughs> you know, just in case there was any doubt. Okay. Um, so she need oops, shit. Ah. Okay. Oh yeah, okay, we find that. So good. again.
What? I think I... I think I didn't add a tofu or something. Man, I'm doing so well. That should have been a perfect day. After all the hard work I'm doing. <laughs> Can't you give me that one? Apparently, almost only counts in with horseshoes and hand grenades, <laughs> or whatever that, that saying is. I just let him out. Yeah. Eric, it really is. <laughs> it's one of those like weird, it hits that, that weird level of like stressful but relaxing at the same time. So yeah, it's like I can, I could just play it for hours and hours. <laughs> oh shit, I forgot the damn, I did that wrong. Oh, uh, well, that was not good. I do! <laughs> and I've played a ton of this game, and for some reason I'm still playing it on stream even though I've already, like, beaten it. Uh, but I just I, I just set myself the, the, the goal that I want to unlock everything, and it's taking a long time. But uh, I'm doing it anyway, because I'm too stubborn to stop. <laughs> All right, hey Ralph, <laughs> you showed up right at the end of my stream, so I'm I'm actually just about to to uh, to end for the night. Let's see, lesson plan ideas. Oh, we did we read that one already. All right, so Far East is done. We never have to deal with that one again. Well, unless I, yeah, no. Um, okay, so we still have a couple more uh, restaurants to cross off our list, but we'll do that next time. Uh, Yep, we are, we're, we're closing in on, on hopefully finally being done with this game. Uh, and I know, right? I, it, there is a strategy element to it. Like it's kind of hard to, 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 to categorize this game exactly in like one category. Um, but yeah, there's, there's a strategy, there's, there's a strategic uh, element to like planning your side dishes and like when to refill them or like planning your menu that kind of thing um but yeah it's not like strategy in in like the typical gaming sense of the of the term um so yeah uh, i think i am done for the night and i will see you guys not tomorrow because i will be taking part in the uh day off twitch uh thing tomorrow um in the hopes that twitch will as i said yesterday get off its ass and do something about the uh about the hate raids. Slam your head into the fryer and hope for the best. Yeah. I mean, that's kind of what I do too. Like, my favorite way to play this game is just to randomize everything um, and just, like, see what, what it throws at me and, and just, like, roll with the punches, so to speak. Um, I don't plan menus at all. I just go, like, whatever you got. I don't care. <laughs> um, but, uh, yeah. So then, yeah. So nothing, no stream tomorrow, but I will see you again next week. Uh, Monday, Dragon Sphere. Tuesday, Cook Serve Delicious 2 again. And then next Wednesday will be more Reseteer. And yeah, that should be it. So, who can I raid tonight? What do we have going on tonight? Ooh, we got... 
that's not Final Fantasy 3, that looks like Ghosts and Goblins. <laughs> uh, I don't know what that is. It's like a Zelda game, maybe? I, I was so embarrassed last night because I, I, I sent you over to um, Ifana Cthulhu, who I thought was playing uh, um, Curse of Darkness or Lament of Innocence, one of the 3D Castlevania games on the PS2. But I was wrong, it was Castlevania 64. <laughs> Which is a 3D Castlevania game, but definitely not one of the ones I thought it was. And I, I, I'm not, uh, I'm, I guess I'm not familiar enough with that game to recognize it just on a brief glimpse. But uh, now I know. Ooh, I haven't, uh, I haven't raided Taco Adventure in a while. He's streaming Dropsy, which is a really weird game. And I should probably play it myself. So... Taco Adventure, there we go. All right, have fun with that, and I will see you next week. Thank you so much for coming by, everyone. Hope you have a good one. Take care of yourself and all that good stuff. See you around, bye.